cutting off access to the Euphrates for Imam Hussein's caravan. After Ubaidullah ibn Ziyad dispatched a large army to confront Imam Hussein, peace be upon him, in Karbala, and had the Imam surrounded from all sides, he sent a message to Umar ibn Sa'd. In it he ordered, Put a blockade between Hussein and his companions and the water, so they may not taste even a drop. Upon this command, Umar ibn Sa'd sent Amr ibn al-Hajjaj with 500 horsemen. They positioned themselves by the riverbank, thereby preventing Imam Hussein, peace be upon him and his companions, from drawing even a drop of water. The meeting of Imam Hussein, peace be upon him, and Umar ibn Sa'd. In this encounter, Imam Hussein aimed to remind Ibn Sa'd of the consequences of his intentions and dissuade him from fighting the grandson of the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him and his progeny. Ibn Sa'd's counter-arguments were baseless. He expressed fear of his house being destroyed, to which Imam Hussein replied, I shall provide you with a better one from my property in Hijaz. However, Ibn Sa'd continued to put forth weak excuses, expressing fear for his family's safety. Imam Hussein realized that he wouldn't be swayed. As he turned away, Imam Hussein proclaimed, May Allah slaughter you in your bed soon, and may he not forgive you on the day of your reckoning. By Allah, I hope that you will enjoy the fruits of Iraq, but briefly. To this, Ibn Sa'd mockingly retorted, There is enough barley to suffice, making light of the situation.